Hi guys, thought I'd just do a quick update on uh, life with the CB1000 and I'm absolutely loving it still. It's, I think, the nicest bike I've, bike I've ever ridden. Um, and I've decided, worked out what I'm going to do regarding changing bits on it. Um, the first thing I'm going to do, well actually, first of all, put a smaller number plate on there, which I think looks better it's not too small so and if I've got one complaint it's the grips were really quite hard so I put some of those puppy grips on and they work they work really well so they're well, well worth getting they're only about 13 quid um, right so the plan is this thing here this plastic bit here you can get that in carbon fiber so that's going to change as is I think the ignition surround as well um, I'm hoping that the old model hasn't changed from this model if you see what I mean I don't think they have I used to have the older model and it looks the same to me so that's the first thing so I think that looked really good um, I did buy a tank pad a rubber one which is a bit silly really because, well I'll tell you why in a minute, but it just spoils it so that's not going to go on there. Um, however, I'm definitely making marks on the tank. I've had to get on there with a the T-cut a couple of times to get off a couple of fine scratches. So I'll have to get a transparent maybe tank pad to just protect that area there. Yeah, so, um, yeah, so that's the first thing. I'm going to get the carbon fiber surround and ignition surround and also they do the carbon fiber front mug guard and the rear one as well in carbon fiber which would look amazing so I might look into that as well what I'm gonna do with the seat the seat is a little bit hard um, but I've actually found the pad that I had from my old model uh, it was a seat pad, gel pad. So what I'm going to do, I'm going to order there's a, uh, an Italian company that do, does covers for these. And they do a really nice diamond quilted one with a very small sort of burgundy stripe down there which kind of matches that. Um, and I'm going to attempt to take this cover off which I think is pretty easy. I've got a staple gun and then put on the new one but also include the the gel um, pad as well. So yeah, so hopefully that will work out. So I think the the cover is a hundred, I think it's about 160 quid for both the pillion and the rider. But I think it will look really nice. They don't do one without a a colour going along there. Otherwise, I would have just got the black one. But the the red or the burgundy is definitely. In keeping with that colour, so that'll be good. Um, yeah, so that's the plan, and uh, I'm still trying to find someone that does panniers. I've had a lot of people sort of reach out to me and say that you can get throwover panniers, which I don't really want, but you could, I suppose. Um, and I have sent SW Motec another email finding out if they're going to be doing these for the new CB1000s because obviously people are going to be owning them and want luggage so we'll see um, yeah but that's it for the moment I hope you guys are well and ride safe and I'll speak to you on the next one